Hi everyone and welcome back to Anxious Beauty. We are reviewing today Beauty Creations, the Alicia palette. Let's get started. Alright guys, so this is the Beauty Creations Alicia palette. Like I said, this video is not sponsored in any way. I bought this from Walmart online, so I just went under Walmart's website, found it, bought it, voila. So it looks like this. The packaging is really cute. It gives me Alice in Wonderland themes, but the name is Alicia, so I'm assuming they couldn't use like Alice in Wonderland for trademark royalty reasons. But this is cute though. Like this is really cute. I dig the theme and there are so many palettes. I didn't realize they had so many. I think this is my second Beauty Creations palette. Pretty sure the first one I got was her BoxyCharm. This is what it looks like outside of that packaging. So still the Alice in Wonderland theme. Got the little teacups right here, little forest, the clock, the um, Ace of Spades and all that from the deck of cards. Really cute. All right, so it's the same picture on the inside. No mirror, but I can forgive it because this is so pr pretty. And then we got the little seal it comes with here. Oh, another little insert. We got a twofer. And then this is what it looks like on the inside. So you've got an awesome choice of mattes and shimmers here. This is definitely a very colorful palette, but I think you could create a nice neutral look with this too. So guys, I'm really feeling like greens and blues today. So I think we're gonna go with that theme Today, I'm gonna to try to use as many colors as I can for you guys. Let me put some eye primer and tape on off camera and I'll see you guys in just a sec. All right guys, eyes are primed, tape is on, we are ready to go. So the first thing I am going to do is I'm thinking maybe going in with this yellow shade right here. So they don't have any shade names, but that's all right. So this yellow right here, and I'm gonna do that right above my crease. I don't want it directly on it. We'll see how pigmented it is. All right, so that is actually pretty pigmented for a yellow. I am happy with that. I am not like a makeup, or not a makeup, but a beauty expert or a professional makeup artist, but this is exciting to me. So literally taking that yellow right on the brow bone. Go on with that yellow one more time. All right, now I'm gonna swatch this brush again because I'm gonna use it again and I don't wanna contaminate colors and mix them. All right, now I am gonna go in with a green and I am thinking this green literally right next to that yellow we just used, right here. And then that's gonna go in my crease. And then I'm gonna actually blend that together with the yellow. That's pretty together. You guys see that? Hopefully it's picking up on camera. All right, so, so far here's that eye, so far is that eye, so far so good. Now I wanna use a blue and I am taking literally the blue probably right next to that. This one right here, so almost like a sky blue. Go in with a clean brush. We'll use this one. Going in with that blue all over the eye. So with just the shades that I have been using, I noticed that it may take a couple of passes on the eyes to kind of build up color, which is fine by me. I just wanted to let you guys know they are buildable and it could be just because of the colors I'm using are kind of going for like the neon. So that might be why too. 
But just wanted to let you guys know. But they are building up very, very nicely. Like that. And of course we are gonna do the same thing on the other eye. One more time with that, I call this my problem eye. So it's not the shade or nothing, it's just my eye. It likes to give me problems. All right, so then there's that eye and there's that eye. Now what I wanna do is take a very small lined brush or a liner brush. And I am thinking maybe <laughs> going in with just a dark color because I do want to try them out. I'm thinking maybe this one right here. So it looks like a black. It might be a black or it might be a navy. Let's see. Oh, it's okay. So it's like a dark navy color, which is very pretty. Swatch as well. I'm going to go in with that one and I'm just going to line my eyes as best as I can. Now, I'm not good at eyeliner, guys, so give me grace on this. All right, so I actually did a pretty good job lining. Like I said, I am not the best at liner, but... All right, so there's that eye and that eye. Mm, do I want to add a shimmer? No, I don't think I'm gonna add a shimmer today, guys. I actually quite like how this is looking. I am gonna clean up the inner corners of my eyes, though, because I do wanna add a shimmer right in the inner corner. All right, and then going in with a small brush here in the inner corner of my eye, I am going to add, I'm thinking this color right here is kind of like a grayish white shimmer shade. Okay hey guys, there's that and that. Now let's take the tape off for the final reveal. And mainly what I use the tape for is just a border because I tend to go crazy with my eyeshadow palette. Or my eyeshadow sometimes. Let me I'm going to clean up my eyes just underneath here off camera real quick and I'll see you guys with my final thoughts. Alright guys, I'm back. Let's talk about my final thoughts on this palette here. So Colors are pigmented, the ones that I've tried, really, really good. Um, you definitely, like I said, have your choice between mattes and shimmers. The blendability was really, really easy, guys. I'm surprised how easy it actually was. I really, really like this palette, and if you guys are interested, I recommend you going and picking yourself up one. Like I said, I got this off of the Walmart website, but I'm sure if you go under like Beauty Creations, like their website, I'm sure you can find this and many more palettes underneath there too. Uh, yeah, I recommend this palette and I love it guys and I'm happy I have it in my collection That's gonna be it for me today guys. I'm gonna go ahead and head out for the day I just love how my eyes are looking one more quick look for you guys before I head out All right guys, I will see you soon with another new video